Let's begin today by changing your color photograph into a black and white image. So these are the tools we're going to use today. An eraser, a drawing pencil, and uh, this is a blending tool. And I'm going to show you in class how to create your own blending tool. First thing I wanna do is notice that my pencil is not particularly sharp, so I'm gonna sharpen it. All right, remember that we have converted our color photograph to black and white. And because we're doing a black and white drawing, that makes it a lot easier to figure out what areas need to be a little darker and what areas need to be a little bit lighter. So you can see that there's a little shadow right here that I've already got kind of drawn in a little bit. But all of this area here is pure white in my drawing and there's grays and uh, darker areas in here. So we're going to add shading today and I'm gonna show you the basic technique for adding shading with a pencil. And we're going to use a really light, light touch and we're gonna move in small circles. So I'm gonna start right here, and I can see that it's not pure white, it's kind of gray through here. It gets a little bit darker through here. And so I'm going to draw very, very lightly with my pencil. And notice that what I'm doing is I'm working in small circles. Now, these are drawing pencils, so they get dark really quickly. I'm gonna come back in here and make this a little darker. And I don't wanna forget about this area right here. And I'm not gonna do the entire drawing, I'm just gonna do a little bit here so you can see. Now, this is my blending tool. As I said, I'm gonna show you how to create one of these yourself so that you don't have to actually go and buy one of these. Um, they're not expensive, but we're gonna use this. And again, just working with small circles, I'm gonna very lightly press down. It doesn't take much pressure. Now you might notice that I start in the dark areas of the shadow, start with the dark and move into the light. So go from darkest to lightest. 